It is April 27th, 2013, uh, just about two miles west of Robert Lee, Texas. As you see, the country around here is uh, pretty droughty. Uh, hadn't rained for some time. Uh, hadn't really rained since last September. Uh, what I've done here is I have uh, planted uh, some acorns, some Texas live oak, uh, using a Groasis water box. I used uh, the acorns off a, off a live oak tree. I took the acorns and uh, put them in water, and those that uh, floated I discarded. Those that sunk I might be uh, good for germination. So I put uh, three acorns in the water box. The water box is lined up east and west, uh, according to that slit you see right there on, on the top of it. And I used a compass, uh, taking in uh, consideration magnetic variation. I actually lined it up uh, about eight degrees uh, east variations, but generally just w east and west uh, will do it. I uh, am going to uh, fill this water box full of water and then I'm going to leave it alone. Uh, if the acorns germinate, the uh, tap roots uh, should drive down and seeking water until they find a good source. This water box has a wick in it. It'll hold about three gallons. It's got uh, uh, the top of it uh, is, is designed so if there is a dew, it will catch the dew and, and put it into the box for storage. But anyway, this wick will wick that water out very slowly, giving the uh, seed enough uh, water to live, but not really to thrive. So the tap root should drive down until they do get uh, to uh, water. And then at that time, the plant uh, should uh, start to prosper and, and pop on up through the top and uh, look like it's pretty healthy. And at that time, you just pull the water box off and uh, use it uh, at a different uh, location. So anyway, we'll see uh, what happens. We'll check it in about maybe a year and see if there's, we've got a live plant. 